hello YouTube and welcome to your ninth Google Chrome extension development tutorial and in this tutorial we'll be continuing where we left from in the previous tutorial so we'll be continuing our extension development of Twitter social toolkit which allows a user to share text images content links page or anything to his Twitter account so I have made some modification to manifest.json from previous tutorials as you can see I have changed the description and given a suitable title and I have also given icons uh, 64, 32, 16 and 128 of this icon the Twitter one icon so that is easier to recognize our extension and the next thing we want to do is to create a background script and I have already created a background script down here in the manifest background scripts and here you go uh, let's create a background script now actually background.js here we go uh, let's give it an alert so let's see if it's working or not we have the extension down here reload ah, it works cool so now to create a right click menu down here we'll need to use a chrome api chrome dot context menus dot create now this api is, is available in only in background environment so to use this API we need to declare some permissions first and the permissions would be as you expected context menus so now we have the permission to modify the context menu that is this menu and let's create a context menu the title should be let's say Twitter social toolkit and the title is thing which appears like this like edit this cookie and go to JavaScript settings our respective titles of their context menus the next thing we want is uh, the context and I'll explain what it does selection and the next thing we like to have is on click this is the JavaScript event listener and my function so so far so good uh, let's create a function my function and uh, let's show the simple alert you just click me fuck so this selection down here what it does is it tells Google Chrome that I want this uh, this uh, menu item to appear only when user has selected some text or anything on the browser otherwise don't appear so let's reload this extension uh, let's see it in action so if I right click there then I don't see any of our Twitter icon but if I select some text and then right click on this text then we see Twitter social toolkit as our icon like we have the selection context here because of the selection context so whenever you do use a uh, user select uh, right clicks on the selected portion then only the user would be able to see our icon or our context menu and when we click this uh, we get an alert you just click me fuck so using this we could create new window or new window basically and add the text to Twitter window so that it's easier for user to share the content so that's all for this tutorial and in the next tutorial we'll be working on the functioning of this extension so see you there pals and thanks for watching the tutorial